So the thing about life is that pain is a part of life. Pain is a part of life as is pleasure. We have to have pleasure to know what pain is and vice versa, right? We have to have pain to know what pleasure is. And yet we as human beings, we basically spend most of our lives trying to avoid pain and trying to move towards pleasure, right? Even though both are part of life. And so we can create elaborate, elaborate external ways of avoiding pain. And we can even begin to come up with more and clever ways of avoiding pain. So think about so many different ways that we might be avoiding certain pains, whether they're little or big. So it could be overworking and just staying overly busy. That's one of the most common and well-accepted ways of avoiding pain is overwork. In fact, we applaud it when someone is just too busy to be able to slow down, to be able to think for themselves, right? And so that can actually create a lot of suffering, like so much of how we create our own suffering. So one of the things to just start to consider is in a very mindful way, in a very gentle way, is there a way that we can turn toward this pain without necessarily just embracing it altogether, but just turning towards the pain, accepting the pain and allowing the pain to pass through us. Because either way, whether it's pleasure or pain, that is all temporary. And so if we can bring in a little bit of this acceptance and moving and turning towards the pain, I can tell you from personal experience and also of course from working with hundreds and hundreds of incredibly busy women who have been suffering a great deal that when we can turn towards the pain, learn how to metabolize the pain and allow it to go, that then on the other side of that pain is actually a freedom, a personal freedom that feels very light. It can really bring in more joy. It can bring in better relationships in our lives, better relationships with ourselves, more focus, even more productivity, if that's what you're looking for. But it does require some amount of slowing down to look at the pain. And so in my group program, The Power Within, this is the exact work that we do and it is so beautiful. So I help really busy women um, through a variety of different techniques. We spend actually two full weeks out of our 12 weeks working on just this and how can we accept the pain, metabolize the pain, particularly if it's emotional well-being. We have a six step method that we go through. And when we begin to implement that, and always we start with really small steps, we start with the small pains and then we can build up from there. And when we can do that, then on the other side, like I said, is all of this really beautiful, beautiful expansion and growth that's waiting for us. So I hope you give this a try.